If Donald Trump were an ordinary person, he would be in grave legal trouble. It is becoming apparent that the special master, Judge Deary, on the Mar-a-Lago case is unlikely to simply let Trump off. He is more likely to take his job seriously, do his work, and then we'll find out exactly what Trump was doing, what those documents said, and why Trump was holding, and we'll ask the question why Trump was holding these important uh, national security related classified documents just kind of casually at his home in Mar-a-Lago. The New York Attorney General, Tish James, has built a very strong case against Donald Trump, primarily around various kinds of fraud. The question this raises for me is what does this do for Donald Trump politically? And my sense is it does a couple of things. It makes him a stronger Republican candidate for the 2024 nomination. The MAGA cult that is the Republican Party, that dominates the Republican Party, sees every legal case against Trump axiomatically, not as evidence that Trump is a criminal, and he is, but as evidence of the witch hunt. But all of this also pushes those in the middle, swing voters, away from Trump. And that could be good news for the Democrats. But the continued presence of Trump as a major player, as a leader of the Republican Party, is, no matter who wins or loses in 2024, very damaging for American democracy.